Hello guys, welcome to Let's Play Pokemon Leaf Green Part 39! In the last episode, we ripped Agatha a new one. And in this episode, we shall be taking care of the last of the Elite Four. Lance, the Dragon Master. I'm sure you already knew that from the... Dragon Ball Z-ish hair! I lead the Elite Four. You can call me Lance the Dragon Trainer. You know the dragons are mythical Pokemon. They're hard to catch and raise, but their powers are superior. You can get a Chitini at the game corner. Virtually indestructible. There's no being clever with them. You're ready to lose? Your Elite Challenge ends with me. You do know there's only three dragon types in this game, right? And Garchomp rips all three of them in half. And Hydreigon rip makes them even worse. Awesome One Piece, by the way. He starts out with Gyarados. Level 56, he's part flying. So even though he's got relatively good special defense, any electric attack from anyone within 10 levels of him should kill him, even from a Pikachu. And note that was a slight exaggeration. Use a powerful and accurate one, you should be fine. Ta-da! Okay, next! He's using Dragonair. For this, I'm going to whip out Charizard. His Dragonair will have Dragon Rage, Thunderbolt, Ice Beam, and Thunder Wave, I think. But it's not going to get the chance to use any of them since I'm going to use Dragon Claw. Dragon is weak to Dragon. And it didn't kill him, surprisingly. I'm going to use Safeguard, which is good because I don't really go with status inflicting ailments anyway. Please don't kill him on the next shot. I want him to waste his full restores on Dragonair. I'd rather not have him use his full restores on Dragonite. That would be annoying. Ah, he only has one. Either that or he's being, just BAI's being smart about it. Alright, next up... is... Aerodactyl. I told you that Aerodactyl is a bitch to fight. Well, I wasn't lying. This Aerodactyl will have Rock Slide, Wing Attack, Hyper Beam, and more likely than not, something else relatively annoying. Anyway, Ancient Power. Yeah, come on, survive. There we are. Ancient Power is relatively weak, but has the chance to raise all stats by one. It's only a 10% chance, as far as I know, so. <sighs> ha, lucky me. Yeah, Lance loves to use Hyper Beam. You may be wondering why I didn't use Ice Beam. Well, Ice is normal against Rock, so... Alright. He's using another Dragonair. And for this... Uh, I'll keep out Ico. Also level 54. This party is no longer protected by Safeguard, so Ice Beam should take care of him in one shot, hopefully. Come on, come on... Yes! Alright, no chance to safeguard for Dragonite. Oh, did I just spoil it, guys? My bad. Alright, for this, I'm going to actually bring out Rhydon for some reason. Don't ask me why. Considering, I think this Dragonite has Hyper Beam, Fire Blast, Blizzard, and Thunder. Or he could have Outrage, which is the most annoying Dragon-type move in the game. Outrage has very high damage for two turns. And then after that... Is that Leftovers or Citrus Berry? Oh well. Ah, there he is. Well, Rhydon's gone. Yeah, Outrage is highly annoying in the fact that it does 90 damage. It usually lasts three turns. Unfortunately for him, it also causes the uh, user to become confused after those turns. Like Thrash. It's the Dragon-type Thrash. But he will not get a chance because... Dragonite's main weakness is he is slow. And being Dragon Flying, quadruple weak to ice. Boom! He's been lawyered. That made no sense. Alright. That's it. He do admit it, but you're a Pokemon Master. Aw, he's called us a Master. Wait, what? Oh. Not for long, he's not. Alright. 
cutting away. All right, I'm done healing. I'm done rearranging. Next up, AJ. Take care, guys. We'll see you for the finale. Well, second to finale next time.